Hey guys, how's it going? This is Hunter from TJJ Games for part 4 in our Dark Souls Let's Play. Alright. Let's get this thing going. So as you can see, we're, we're not in the same place as we ended last time. But the reason, I mean, you guys didn't really miss out on anything because all I had to do was get past that dragon we saw. And that's just long and boring and nobody really needs to see that. Get some free souls. Okay. Um, there's some good loot out on this bridge. Gotta kill the zombies though. Out. Gotta kill the zombies first. Oh, missed that one. Okay. They're all getting in the corner. Oh. Ow. My gosh, what just happened? Like, my sword deflected off of nothing. I better not die right here, because that's, that's not a very good intro to the episode. Man, I'm sorry, I must be under-leveled or something, because I'm not doing much damage. Okay, let's see. Okay. That guy, too. Okay, I don't think we'll die now. Come on, hit me. And... One more time. Alright, there we go. Got helmet, no, we're not going to wear. Armor, we're not going to wear. And a crossbow, you might use that in the future. Soul Nameless Filter, and here's the best one, alright, the Claymore. Now the Claymore is a really good weapon because, I mean, it's not the fastest, but it does a lot of damage. And fortunately, I leveled up strength enough so that we can use it effectively with one hand. Okay. Now, up here, there's like a little mini-boss. Alright, a couple of cronies. See, so that claimer does really good damage. <laughs> Gotta slowly attract the attention of the small guys. Okay. Let's get on with it. Come on, guys. Let's make this quick. That guy's going on the offensive. Just block and hit a couple times. Dead. Alright, now let's get this guy. Tight knight. Alright. And boom. Block. Okay. So far, so good. Well, let's just go up here. And. Let's get this guy's attention. Oh, I should have hit again right there. Block, hit. Okay. Set. Tight night. It's good. Ow. Alright. Let's get these guys. Boom. And I think we have alluring skulls right here. Those are used for, like, distracting enemies. So you could throw them, or, up oh, there's, it's coming after me. Easy kill. So alluring skulls are used to distract kind of bigger enemies, like the boar down there. Gonna have to equip it first, though. Alright, let's get going. So we just throw one over there. Okay. And he'll like the boar goes all crazy. Alright. You should slowly walk back over there. All we have to do is stab his butt. No oh, no fire! Oh god. Ah. Oh, the fire should hurt the boar, though. Except he hits me. That sucks. Are you kidding? He just died after... Oh, my God. Now I have to... I have to do it all over again. Alright. Well. Let's see how this goes.
Shouldn't be as hard at this time. Alright, you guys don't want to see this. I'll just cut it out. And we're back. Okay, just chill these archers. Alright. Okay. Now, I have an idea here. Instead of just taking them head on. Oops, I accidentally used the alluring skull in there. I'm going to throw some black fire bombs at them. Alright. Let's take those out. And if I throw it at the smaller guy, it'll hit both of them and kill him. Because their weakness is fire. Oh. Wasted that one. Okay, got, got another one. Boom. Okay, now let's finish this. Run out of the way. And get the right. Wait for the right moment. No. Ooh, right up the butt. That doesn't look very comfortable. I love it. Just kidding, that's gross. Fang Borhelm. So that's what all the kids have been talking about. I never got that before. It looks cool, though. <laughs> they used to look kind of stupid, though. I'm like, that's okay. Bit of defense. Alright, and I remember there's an ambush here. Okay. Let's get down. And there. There. Alright, just a bunch of weak guys. You still, uh, pro tip, you still gotta be careful, even if they're just a bunch of pygmies like these guys, because, you know, I, I have died countless times from just getting ganged up on by those guys. It's, it's annoying. This guy. There should be a key down here. Am I correct? Yes, mystery key. And then, we go up the ladder. Right, and there's a mm, few more guys up here. Oh, he hit me. Take them both out with one swing. Okay. There's a soul of a large soul of a um, nameless soldier, I think. Or no, just just lost and dead. It's actually good to wear heavy armor when doing these kind of puzzles because it makes you go slower. Alright. And we have to traverse the white light, but luckily there is no boss on the other side. And so... You go forward. <clears throat> and on to the next bonfire. Oh, there's an enemy. Let's see if we can sneak up on him. And no, hurt is coming from a mile away. <clears throat> and he's pretty tough. You see, he's not taking much damage. Has a lot of health. We should be able to take him out though. Let's get him. Oh yeah. Oh no. Oh my. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> that was literally the closest. I've ever been to death without dying before. That's I I think we can make it through this guys, don't worry. Yep, okay, we got him. Wait, no. There. That's just yes to this. Okay. And there should be a night shield? Yeah. That's shield's a bit better than the one we have right now. Alright. Go up these stairs. Okay, and there's one guy right there. Should be pretty easy. I think I just kick him and up oh, round. Ow. 
Got him. Okay. There should be another thing going on down here. Oh, oh, no, I'm cornered. Move! God, no, I'm running out of stamina. Please stop. No. No. God, we. Okay, I y y uh, might as well just. <sighs> All right. Well, let's watch these loading screens, and I'll probably just cut ahead to that staircase again. Okay, here we are again, and hopefully we don't mess it up this time. Let's get their attention. All right. Look, let's take this guy out first, he's the bigger threat. One down, one to go. Alright, see if he'll hit me. If not, we'll just kick him like that. Oh, let's recover. That's a lot of souls, don't want to miss out on those. And... And here's a little area right here. There's a very good weapon over here. Uh, make sure if, you, um, if you're watching this for like a walkthrough, uh, imprint this place into your mind, because this is a very important place. So just in case you dive here and you spawn back at your um, bonfire, just so you don't have to go around, always open this. It's not a trap. Okay, and there is a weapon up here. I believe it's the halberd. Yes, this is um quite literally one of the best weapons like early on in the game. It's one of the best. It's quick and it has a lot of range. I'll demonstrate right here. <laughs> I'll make quick work of this guy. See, easy. Very good weapon. <clears throat> you know, let's just go over here. Couple guys down here. Thought I could block that. Let's get these guys. Only one archer left. Let's see if we can get a backstab. <laughs> Super graphic with the halberd, cause like, I mean, it's like a huge axe spear on the end, and it like goes all the way through them. So as you see, I avoided going to the right, because there's a boss in there. And for now I just want to save the bonfire. So that's where we're going. Alright, just head downstairs. And finally, another bonfire. Let's level up a bit. Alright. Alright guys, thank you for watching, I appreciate your support, and we will see you guys on the next episode where we will be meeting the uh, blacksmith.